so yeah! What a rumble weekend it is here in San Antonio, Texas! Let me hear you make some noise! That's for you, Brad! All right, boys, came to this mall. Apparently there's a wrestling figure store in here and stuff like that. Actually, first we're gonna grab some grub because I'm about to starve to death. Apparently there's a really good store in here. We'll see. I think I saw this store on the Major Wrestling Figure Podcast and they actually had my video playing in the store. So hopefully that's this mall, I don't know. But all right, boys, I got the bourbon chicken with the fried rice. Steven's got the, what? Orange chicken and sesame chicken with fried rice. And then what'd you get? Chick-fil-A, Bo, Bo this man. Apparently the wrestling figure store here is overwhelming from what we've heard, so looking forward to it, but I gotta eat first. Alright guys, so we were told we would be overwhelmed by this wrestling action figure store, and by God were we, and not just by the amount of things and the actual things that they had on the walls, the WWE action figures, the memorabilia, all the different action figures, playsets, things that were on display, man. I was blown away not only by the product, but by the service and the people that work there. It was an unbelievable experience, man. If you guys live in the San Antonio area, even if you're an hour, I would even say two hours out or you're going to the San Antonio area, man. And you have to hit up the Rolling Oaks Mall and go to the wrestling shop and tell them that MDT sent you. I was overwhelmed by Oscar's hospitality, his entire staff. It was an unbelievable experience, and I had a, a great deal of fun, man. It was so great, and I was completely overwhelmed by the experience. But I hope you guys do enjoy the toy hunt, man. It was incredible. Great perspective, great atmosphere. Overall, beautiful display. There's a freaking wrestling ring in the middle of the store. Let's get into this toy hunt. All right, guys, so we're going in this store called The Wrestling Shop. It's in this, in the Rolling Oaks Mall, I think, or something like that. It's really amazing. The owner is super amazing as well. Uh, big fan of the channel, apparently, and it, it was an awesome introduction, man. He was freaking out, and I appreciate him so much. Appreciate him for having us out, but I'm going to toy hunt this place. And uh, it's really incredible. Fantastic place, man. They got the Punjabi prison over here on display. Got the little mini hell in a cell. Punjabi prison. You gotta have great Kali in here. Jurassic Express, got some ring giants over here. There's the ring in here. Poster of Austin. Got a little bit of Marvel Legends. Got some toy biz. I mean, Jesus. Got walls of basics and elites over here. Got the new Target exclusive three pack. Got some best of paper view build a figure elites. Got some older stuff. Got new legends. The Chase Jake the Snake that, that was evading me for so long. Got Junkyard Dog down here. Got some unmatched Fury. Got Jeff Hardy in the house. Looking pretty good. Entrance Grace Jeff Hardy. Legends Edge, Bobby Heenan. We got some treacherous trios right here. Very cool three pack. We got more Legends. Never found this Macho Man either. So I could feel some, I'm de I definitely got to make some purchases, man. Got to make some purchases, I'm trying to figure out exactly what I want to get, but this store is incredible. Never found DDP in the wild either. We got some stuff in some ringside defenders as well. So you got some elites here in the defender cases. Got some jacks down here. They have a whole another wall full of elites. Got a Chase Apollo Cruise. We got Elite 57 Hardy. Got some classics, Jacks classic superstars. One of 3,000, Sonny. And then he's got my video playing, which is just truly crazy. My mind's blown right now, so that's amazing. Man's got a whole ring inside of his store. Apparently they're having a show here tomorrow. I don't know when this video is releasing, but they're gonna have it on the Saturday of the Rumble. And then you have this massive wall of elites right here, which is really cool. Looks amazing. Like, I mean, truly all kinds of old elites. You got current elites, old elites. Hopefully you guys can hear me pretty good, but I mean, any modern elite you can think of, I mean, they, I feel like they have it, man. I mean, they got Elite 98 Finn Balor up here. Where's it at? Yeah, right here. Got elite 99 Riddle and Elite 98 Finn Balor. You got some Adam Cole. I mean, dude, all kinds of stuff. Truly beautiful store. Looks amazing in here. Walls of elites, line wall to wall. Got the flashback, Shawn Michaels right here, looking good. Beautiful, bro, beautiful. 
And then even in here, you got the Fusion Collection DVD. I used to, I used to collect these. Got the WrestleMania 34 mini. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, so I want to take you back through. We got Walls of AEW. They got some chases behind the register as well. The kindness and the appreciation that we've been shown here has been amazing. So I greatly appreciate the wrestling shop for having us. Uh, he didn't expect me coming by. I just kind of showed up. And he's been nothing but nice. And the hospitality has been amazing. So a huge shout out to him. But we got some Hall of Fame elites. We got uh, some Lucy's right here looking good. You got the Legends of Lucha Libre weapons pack. Don't have that. I need that light tube, honestly. Uh, got some random stuff over here. Uh, some accessories. I mean, this is the kind of store that you want. You know what I mean? Oh, snap. We got some. They even have Major Bendy's in the house. So we got some Major Bendy's. You got Major Mark, Swoggle, Brian, and Matt all lined up right there. Looking good. We got some ringside exclusives. We got the Brody Lee two pack. We got the AEW Supreme Walmart Cody. I mean, tons and tons of stuff, bro. It looks incredible in here, and they also have cabinets full of Lucy's. So, I mean, it has been. I'm honest. I'm I'm overwhelmed to be honest with you. Super, just appreciative of everything, man. Oh, I almost missed the one of three thousand Dusty over here, man. Got more major pod stuff in the back. Some replica championships, ringside exclusives. You got some chase figures up here, some belts. Amazing setup, bro. Amazing setup. Looks fantastic in here. Security cameras, of course, got to. You got to protect the goods. On this side, we got some Ultimate Editions all the way through. Undisputed Era 3 pack at the new rock ultimate you can probably hear my voice twice because i'm on the on the jumbotron here but got some old legends men on card beautiful looking packaging right here man they look fantastic got the two packs ravishing rick rude man i'm, I'm just overwhelmed man i'm overwhelmed with Joy. I'm overwhelmed with gratitude. I don't even know what to say right now, but we do have some Lucy's in here. Got a custom elite Chris Benoit, Mr. Kennedy, Funaki. Dude, very quality customs in here, dude. They look insane. Oh, so now I got Rick Martel, Bruiser Brody. We got some loose elites back here. I also took out the Cyclops and Deadpool Finn Balor customs and I had them on the cabinet, so I'll, I'll plug that footage in there. But those look incredible as well. Finn Balor elites looking really, really good. Looks like we got some more loose elites in here. You got Chuck. Very quality Chuck, dude. Oh my god. Fantastic head sculpt. Carrie Von Eric. You can feel plenty of holes in the collection in here, man. I mean, I, it is just truly beautiful. Got Elite 32 Cody back there. That's your winner of the Royal Rumble. Again, I don't know when I'll post this because I'm not near my editing software, so I won't be able to post this until after I get back, but it's truly incredible in here, man. Truly incredible store. Amazing people. Got TNA Hardy in the bag. Spotlight Vince. No way, Jose. Got Sandman back here, looking good. All right, guys, moving on to the next cabinet. We got more loose elites. Sort of miscellaneous through here. Oh, nice little Luke Harper Elite 35 with the shirt off. Nice elites. Kind of stuff here. buy something man you gotta buy something with the hospitality that's been shown man i mean i was gonna buy something anyway but i feel i mean just feel led to anyways but it's beautiful all right guys so oscar here yeah very brad. friendly very very helpful big fan of the channel I brad it so i appreciate the brad brad <laughs> no, so so check it out so uh we're in the vault right now uh this has uh 
you know, nobody's really, really back here. So, you know, MDT shows up in San Antonio, Texas. They come to the wrestling shop. You're going to grant them that access for sure. <laughs> so, so yeah, man, here it is. Uh, just just to, to show you guys just just really quick what we have. Uh, excuse the mess, right? But, but yeah, uh, bo Box of Legends. I'm going to be putting so, some stuff out here, Brad. So All we're right. going to be moving stuff here. We're going to be... Okay, so we got some stuff right here. Beautiful. This is what we have here. We got a, a, a box full of Thunder Roses right here. Okay, okay. So yeah, she, man, you know, I, I've met, I've known her since, my goodness, it was almost like uh, when she was just starting in her journey. So watching her action figure, it's just super cool, man. And uh, we, we do meet and greets here as well. She's in meet and greets here. I, I remember when she won the championship, which was here in San Antonio in a cage match. Uh, she came by the, the following day. We took a picture with the belt and everything, and I'm just so proud of her and just so happy that she has her action figures. And we got a box full of them. I yeah, love yeah, it. I love yeah. It. I love it. You got you to support the ones that yeah, support you, bro. Absolutely, man. So uh, that's you know, there's, there's a couple of them. Look, we got we got a bunch of like LJNs just 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 roaming around here. Uh, a whole bunch of. The newer stuff that we have here. If anybody want a Punjabi prison? There you go. I, I, the one on display out there look good. Oh yeah, hey. we, we have one out there on display as well. A bunch of miscellaneous stuff, more LJNs. My damn toys, my goodness. I was just letting him know, uh, you know, before he started filming that uh, I'm super thankful for him being a part of the community and uh, just what a what a wonderful uh, opportunity for us for for MDT to, to come on over here and 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 showcase us. So thank you so much. So if you're not subscribed, subscribe right now. Oh, I appreciate it, dude. Sure. Thank you again, man. The hospitality, the appreciation you show me has been just bar none, man. I'm I'm truly just. I was talking on the camera when I was toy hunting around the store. I'm just so grateful. I mean, that's really all I can say. I appreciate you. I Thank appreciate you, the store. Yeah, yeah look, at, look at some of these goodies over here. You got Defining Moments Rock. We got some NWO Scott Hall back here. So check this out. Uh, if you guys have loose figures and if you have scuffs on them, I, I, so nobody nobody talks about this, but this, this product right here, Mr. Clean Magic Eraser, oh my gosh, it works wonders with this <laughs> stuff. You can take the scuffs right off. What do we have? What do we got over here, Brad? <laughs> we got some, say yo chico, right? There you and go. Some rare stuff hey, just hanging yeah. out here. A man's got like 10 little bubbly Jerichos over oh, here. Yeah. Just, just, just chilling out. Oh, yeah. We got, we got a, a ringside exclusive. And, and this is, so we buy, sell, and trade here. So every day, I mean, we, we, we have collections. We buy collections. Uh, uh, what's in here, Brad? The Brad drops are getting me. The Brad drops are getting me. Yeah. yeah the do you do you call people Brad in your everyday life sometimes? So I mean, you know, I got it from you. Yeah, so, of course. <laughs> uh, check this out. So these are gold intercontinental championships. These are custom made uh, by Two Sweet Customs. Uh, and, and check it out. Amazing. If you have a gold figure or custom Ahmed Johnson figure, those will be fantastic for that. Dang, it's getting uh, we got metallic a, on there. A box Looking full good. of Nexus. A bag full of Nexus. Okay. So, yeah, we have that over here. A uh, couple of Legends over here on this side. I know we have a couple of the Von Erics in a box here as well. So, yeah, Matt Hardy's. Plenty of Matt Hardy rings had exclusives yeah, over there. Yeah, check this out. Slim Jim, Macho. Beautiful. Uh, this is the ones that they use and then the gas stations yep, and stuff. Absolutely. So, so yeah, we have that. We got some autograph stuff here, just chilling. One of the the, the 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 common questions that we have is, do you guys ship? We don't do any shipping. We're 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 from the Stone Age, man. We we just we rather have individuals come on in here, have a, have fun, have an experience. We have the wrestling ring out there. We encourage everybody to come take pictures. There, you see you see the guys out there taking pictures with the belts and stuff. So just having a good time. Rumble weekend, guys. Uh, uh, MDT in the house. We're just doing it here. Yeah, yeah I love absolutely. it. I love it. I love it. Sounds good. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, guys. So he's got this this box full of some Crispin Wally. So he's got the yellow gear here, looking beautiful. I only have one Crispin Wally now. After um, some, I had to make some cuts there, but beautiful looking. Who made these? Too sweet. Again? Too sweet as Too well. Sweet again? Yeah. So big props to Too Sweet Customs on Instagram, but great looking formula. Looks great. Um, he's even got some uh, some Zack Ryder. Matt Cardona figures in here, full of those. He's got basics. Got another Benoit. Looks like this is his uh, Rumble gear. So it looks great. Speaking of the Rumble. Speaking of the Rumble. Black and red. Oh, he's even got the Ghostbusters. Zack Ryder. <laughs> Very badass. Very clean. I'm not even a Ghostbusters fan. I like that gear. That's a really cool one right there. Yeah, very yeah, dope, bro. Yeah, look, check it out. So just real kind of, real quick, got some Zack Ryders. Uh, yeah. 
Yeah, a couple of the basics turn into elites uh -huh. right here by Too Sweet as well. Uh, and then check this one out. He got a kick when he saw this. Oh yeah, that's dope. <laughs> got the Ghostbuster Rider. And a couple of more um, I have just waiting to, to be customized. So these are just some of, some of the, the things that we have here. Man, I have, if you guys like accessories, I'm a major, major accessory fan. I have boxes and bins, bins full of just accessories, just randomly here, just just, ran, just randomly, just picking out a bag, just, just randomly. You're looking like me over here. <laughs> yeah, I'm the same way, I got drawers full, boxes full, just all kinds of stuff. Man, there you go, and a whole, whole bunch of other project stuff that we're doing here. Uh, I can't wait to get my Billy and Chuck's customs, so. so. Dude, the Chuck custom out there was fantastic. So yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. So I'm, I'm waiting for, uh, these are gonna be redone with the red gear, so. Yeah, um, a little bit of preview of the vaults that we have here at the wrestling shop. For those of you who don't know, we're in San Antonio, Texas, Rolling Oaks Mall, upper level, across from Hot Topic. We're open daily. Thank you so much, MBT, for stopping by. Yeah, and I it's a rumble you, weekend. Yeah, thank you, man. I I'm ready to rumble. It. Truly, let's go. What's up, man? How you doing? I'm a big fan, bro. I, I appreciate it, dude. Jack Thank you so much, man. Oh, that's so cool. Bro, it's crazy meeting you right now. <laughs> I appreciate it. This, this, this was really fast. This was just unexpected. It's pretty cool. Dude, that's Brad, awesome, Brad, Brad, it's like you're having a meeting greet here, Brad. <laughs> hey, let's set, let's set it up. Let's set it up. Jeez, God. Look at this. No, I'm kidding. I appreciate y'all, man. Thank y'all so much for watching and tuning in, man. Y'all are great. I appreciate y'all so much, dude. Y'all going to the Rumble? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're just right now, we just came back from it. Yeah, that we just left there too. It was pretty sweet. I like it. I'm gonna be sitting on the floor. Uh, I'm gonna wear a uh, an MDT jersey I had made. Oh, cool. So I'll, I'll probably stick out with the swords. I'm gonna say bright pink like that. So, well, I appreciate y'all, man. Thank y'all. Nice meeting you. Oh, nice meeting y'all, man. I appreciate y'all so much. So while I was at the wrestling shop, I did meet dozens of fans, man. It was unbelievable. I appreciate everybody I met out there so very much. I got a few clips, but I did not get everybody. I really need to just hire a filmer to follow me around, man, because it's hard to like be in the moment and also think about recording it and getting it on film and things like that. So I do apologize for some of that, man. But I hung out for a little bit and got to meet some more people and I was just having the time of my life at this store bro all right guys down here we do have a basic case right here so tons and tons of basics I mean you're talking about females every single basic really of uh, all kinds of superstars man so you got all these and they even have loose belts and stuff like that so this is kind of a if you're a wrestling figure collector man the wrestling shop in San Antonio Texas I th I'd say it's worth the drive bro make the drive if you're you know an hour out a couple hours out make the drive bro make make the drive that's all I can really say but all kinds of basics from all the different eras great crowd fodder right here and then up here he's got loose shirts I mean it's like an eBay store but it's a brick and mortar so you can walk in here but you got loose championships all kinds of stuff man so I, I love it it's fantastic another shot of everything man it's a beautiful store truly beautiful store it's a beautiful shot man look at this place Whatever y'all want to do, man. If y'all just want to say something or whatever. We got fans of the MBT channel here. What's up, guys? Hi. I appreciate y'all. We even got mom here. Hi. I appreciate y'all for watching, man. Thank y'all. Oh, thank y'all. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. He's from Pennsylvania? Yeah. So Mike Dan Toys is from Pennsylvania. Interesting. Tell me more about Tell me more about What's his favorite uh, uh, attire? What's his favorite attire? He's got a favorite attire. Attire. He's got a favorite attire. I appreciate it. Is that you? That's me. What the fuck? Yeah, dude. What? <laughs> well, hi. What's up, dude? Nice to meet you. What's awesome. your name? Rudy. Rudy? Awesome, bro. Look at this guy right here. Yeah, so we, go. we got, uh, from your reaction, we have people yeah. walked up to you and said, I'm marking out. Yeah. Th th this was legit. We had reactions that were not caught on film that were like, oh my I, god. I hate, my that's why I had to film it. I had to film it because I've missed like five people's yes, reactions dude, already. Reaction like, like, Good to meet you. Likewise, sir. Likewise. Do you mind being on camera? I love being on camera. Oh, okay. been on TV before. Hey, you look handsome. You look handsome. Likewise. Uh, appreciate it. <laughs> Hey, this is the Wrestling Shop in San Antonio. I've been following my damn toys for a while. Nice to meet them in person for the first time. Thanks, bud.
All right, guys, I'm finally back home from San Antonio, Texas. This is the end of the video for the wrestling shop toy hunt that we did there at the Rolling Oaks Mall, man. Unbelievable store, unbelievable hospitality. I will never forget the experience that I had at this store. The displays were amazing. The figure selection was amazing. And just the overall staff, man. Oscar is a great dude. The kindness and the hospitality he showed me when I was in the store and just his entire staff, man, truly just A1, top of the line. Highly recommend you go in there and check it out, but I do want to go into my haul before we end this toy hunt video. I know it's a little bit outside the box, but I had to go visit this wrestling store, and since I got so so much great footage. Had to make a toy hunt video on it, but let's get into the things that I actually picked up at the wrestling shop. So the first thing that I did grab was one of the chases. I got the Series 5 1 of 5,000 chase John Moxley figure from Series 5. This is one that I do not have yet. I, I have yet to own this one. I saw it there in the store. Had to grab it. You know, I had to grab it right there, and I'm glad to have this. I am going to put this in the Defender and put it up on the massive wall of AEW action figures, and you know, I was missing this chase, so I wanted to fill that hole. I think it's the only chase he had in the store that I did not have yet, so I felt like that was meant to be. It gave me a great deal on it, so I did secure the John Moxley figure. Outside of that, this is not an item that I got from the wrestling shop. This is what I got from WrestleCon that I did not reveal in my Royal Rumble vlog from yesterday. If you guys missed our Royal Rumble vlog, I sat front row at the Royal Rumble for 2023. Definitely go check that video out. It's like a 45 minute long essay on my visit to the Royal Rumble and everything about that entire trip. Definitely go check that out, but this is what I picked up from WrestleCon. I picked up one of my favorite elites that Mattel has ever made. And that is the Elite 91 Rob Van Dam in the Tiger Stripes autographed by RBD here. And it is in a Defender. You guys know that these new WWE Elite figure packaging is very, very flimsy. And it gets crazy. It's so crap, man. It's, it's honestly crap. But this one was in really good condition. I checked all the edges and I'm not going to take it out of the, I'm not going to take it out of the Defender. It is signed by RBD. Five star right there from, I think it was High Spots. It's even got the JSA Certificate of Authenticity on it. And I was excited to get this. So I did not get this from the wrestling shop, but I did want to showcase this in a haul's video. So I did get the Elite 91 RBD autograph. So hyped for this, man. This is a great piece. This is, I think this is the only autographed Elite I have in my collection. I made it, I made it my one of my favorite Elites that Mattel's ever made. So outside of the RBD and the Moxley, now this is something that Oscar did out of the kindness of his heart. Since he was a big fan of the channel, he did hook me up with the custom Elite Chris Benoit from the 2004 Royal Rumble. One of my favorite memories of wrestling as a kid, one of my favorite wrestlers growing Growing up as a kid was Chris Benoit and I love the figure. Very well made customs. I think Two Sweet Customs did make this. It looks just like his gear. This is fantastic. I think this is my second Chris Benoit in my collection and of course we're separating the wrestler from the actual human being. And this is a very well made custom and I appreciate Oscar for this. He gave me this for complete free so I appreciate Oscar for his kindness on the gift of the Chris Benoit Custom Elite and he hooked me up with this wrestling shop chair that looks brilliant so I'm definitely going to be using this and having this close to the heart and uh, commemorate the whole trip, so I think that's fantastic. That is pretty much going to wrap up this toy hunt video from the Wrestling Shop, man. I hope you guys did enjoy. I know the last couple videos have been a little bit outside the box, something that we don't typically do here on the channel, but I had to make videos on our Royal Rumble trip, man. It was a ton of fun. Truly unforgettable experience. I know that I've said that so many times over this past week or these last couple videos and talking about the trip, talking about how amazing it was, but I, I just have to tell you guys how much it touched my heart to meet all these people, to meet all the fans out there that came up to me, that spoke highly of the channel, man. It was, it was just just unforgettable, and I'll always hold that close to my heart. But thank you guys so very much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you missed the Royal Rumble vlog, go check it out. And I appreciate you watching this video. But thank you guys for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Huge shout out to the Wrestling Shop and Oscar again for everything this past week. I'm getting the hell out of here. Thank you. Have a blessed one, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>